Midfielder and forward Elijah Agu is a standout junior for the Elon Phoenix men's soccer team. He has played with the team all three years so far at Elon. Chris, the coach, had been watching me play since I was an academy and younger player, and um, so I had always known him. And uh, it was pretty close to home, so I like the fact that I'd be able to go home and visit um, whenever I would like to. And I like the campus, and I like the way the, um, the team played, so it was a pretty easy decision for me. Elijah is one of the top players in the Colonial Athletic Conference. He has ranked all season amongst the best in the conference in points and goals. This is not the peak for Agu, though. I think there's a lot of room to grow. I think I'm nowhere near the player I'd like to be still. Um, I've always had aspirations since I was a little kid of playing professionally, and if I can do that, I'd still love to. Elijah has not always put up these numbers at Elon. In fact, he has not always been a starter for the Phoenix either. His first two years on the team were spent as a reserve. It was hard at first. I expected to come in and be able to, you know, start and play a lot for the team. And then whenever I didn't do that, it was hard and I got frustrated. Um, but the coaches really worked with me and helped me um, get accustomed to the program. And now that I am playing, I'm glad I'm able to show people what I can do. Elijah scored one goal all of last season. Now he averages nearly one goal a game. His work ethic this past offseason has a lot to do with that. I think it was a lot of hard work over summer and um, watching a lot of video and just making sure that I'm doing everything that I'm supposed to do. Um, whenever I get a chance, I try to capitalize it and make the most of it, and um, I feel like that's what I've been able to do this year. Whether on the sidelines or the pitch, Elijah has learned a great deal over these past three years at Elon that has helped fuel his personal rise. It's more about the off the field stuff than the on the field stuff that matters. Um, a lot of the stuff on the field comes from how you do off the field. And uh, it's just being a good person all around and as a whole, which helps you play well on the field. The coaches talk to us a lot about it's family first, then school, soccer, then yourself. So um, you just need to prioritize and make sure that um, you're doing the things you need to do both on and off the field. While Elijah has spent a lot of time figuring out his game himself, he knows his personal success would also not be possible without his teammates. They always encourage me and um, they're always helping me uh, on the field and off the field. So um, whenever I got into the position, I felt comfortable and they were all helping me and happy for me. As for the younger guys who are in the position that he once was, Elijah has short and sweet advice. Keep working hard and your time will come. And when your time comes, you have to make the most of it. And that's what um, I think I did, and I'm glad that it's worked out. The Phoenix have played well so far this season. Elijah hopes his strong play can help lead his team to an NCAA tournament bid. I mean, I'd like to make it, or I'd obviously love to win it, but um, to make it to at least like the Sweet 16 or Elite 8 would be great.